my name is Rabu Reza, and I, I have been working with uh, pharma industry for over 25 years now, and with Beximco Pharma for more than 20 years. Now, for the last 10 years, I'm in, in my current position as Chief Operating Officer of uh, Beximco Pharma. One particular achievement. Uh, in my view, actually, our presence in the U.S. market um, as a first and only Bangladeshi pharma company remains our biggest achievement. And the, re the reason why I'm saying this, basically, it is not only a milestone for Bexamco Pharma or uh, as a whole for the pharma industry of Bangladesh, but, you know, uh, it, it shows a strong testimony of our stringent quality standards and compliance that we maintain and put into our practice, um, you know, in our daily operations. And that's the reason I think um, entry into the largest market uh, in the world, you know, for Bangladeshi medicine, this is basically one of the key milestones for us. One additional example I'd like to give of our innovation and our, uh, you can say, promptness uh, in delivering things. During this COVID-19 pandemic, we became the first uh, pharma company to introduce a generic version of a Remdesivir for COVID-19 treatment. And until now, Remdesivir is the only uh, approved, US FDA approved product for COVID-19 treatment and our, under the brand name Bemsevere. Super Brands um, to me is not just about a brand recognition that another brand recognition awareness. It is actually about trust. And that trust is not just by our customer, they trust on our products or services. It's also a big motivator for our employees and other stock stakeholders. And uh, actually tells um, you how we are entrusted and how we deliver on our promises. You know, so I think in a nutshell, that is my view on achieving or uh, being awarded the super brand status.